My father was a veterinarian, a health officer, and a biologist. The majority of of a story not truthful, that he came here because he was a poor boy, an immigrant, to make money, to try to find fortune. No. In his life, he was always guided and pushed by spirit of adventure. Do you have any memories at all, Mr. Valentino, of your uncle? I sure have, though more than 50 years have gone by. I remember him when I met him for the first time. I was just a little boy of about, I would say I was about seven or eight in Campo Basso, where my father was officiating as a government uh, employee. And uh, he came with his uh, Wazang sport car. Though I've seen automobiles before there, I've never seen a car like that. And also to know that all of a sudden, you know, I would be eye to eye, you know, with, with an idol, with, with somebody that everybody was talking about it. Uh, it, it. It just excited me to no point at all, which I can never, ever forget. And then when we really met, uh, Rudy took a liking to me immediately. He liked children and uh, he had few presents for me and I was absolutely eager, you know, to tear into it and see what it was from America. And later on, you know, he sent me a uh, bicycle, my first bicycle, and so on and so forth. So I can never forget that moment. That was, I would say, about 1922 or 1923. Let's say this story about the life of all the songs. Orphans, I mean, 